no question about it. It is cold and while many of us grabbed our jacket, sweater or hat just to stay warm, the cold air can affect more than what we wear. Meteorologist Steve Mondero is here with some tips. Yeah, it's actually going to be our tires in our car. The oh. air in our tires. Yeah, when the temperatures drop, you may see that little light go on on your dashboard as that cold air creeps into Hampton Roads. Uh, waking up this morning in the 30s, waking up tomorrow morning in the 30s. When you get these big temperature changes, oftentimes when the temperatures drop, you may see this little light on your dash. That's your tire pressure. It's not your engine light. It's nothing bad. You just need air, more air in your tire. Reason being, let's dive into some thermodynamics. Why don't we? Yeah, well, warm Warm air and the molecules that are associated with warm air are moving around more. It's like when you're exercising or you're at a dance party and you're moving around, you're bumping into each other. You need more space. So warm air expands. Cold air does the opposite. It slows down, right? And then it ends up shrinking, so to speak. So the air in your tire shrinks essentially when the temperatures drop. So the pressure of your air may seem like it is lower and that check end or that check the tire pressure light may come on. So that may be something you see tomorrow morning as the freeze warnings and frost advisories in place. We may see some frost in a few locations as well. Don's got the latest on